Okay, we want to solve fifth problem of SMT 2022 team part. It's Stanford math tournament, but by what idea? Newton's idea, or we can say better, Newton's some idea. So let me tell you something about this. Also, we want to prove it with Vieta's formula. So let me tell you two important things here. When we want to solve this problem, Vieta's formula is so much famous and it's useful in many problems, but Newton's sum is less important, but recently we see some problems, for example, SMT 2022, and also for Hong Kong, HKIMO 2022, we see in these two exams, Newton's sum idea is useful. So we understand maybe in recent years, they want 2022, and after that 2023 maybe they want to so use this idea more newton's sum idea now so we should learn also in amy problems the year i don't remember uh, but if you want it feel free to send message to my whatsapp number i will tell you in what amy prop year what year for amy for america olympiad i will tell you that newton's sum is useful uh -huh. also i released some other ideas about some problems of Stanford math tournament Harvard. You can use the card on top of my video and uh, solve other problems and improve your problem solving and learn new ideas. Okay, so please subscribe my YouTube channel now and turn on notification to have next videos and like my video. So let's solve this problem. At first, I want to tell you Rieta's formula and we want to reach important things. And after that, Newton's some idea okay so it is we can say it, the roots are a b c so you consider x minus a x minus b x minus c okay if we consider the coefficients here corresponding coefficient x cube x cube now um coefficient of x squared here is negative three here is what negative a negative b negative c so a plus b plus c is three if you consider the coefficient of x here, it will be uh, negative ac, uh, negative a times negative c, it's ac, ab plus ac plus bc. It will be negative 4 and 5 is negative abc, so abc will be what? Will be negative 5. Now, it is Vieta's formula, we found these things. Now Newton's sum idea is what? So. We define SK equals AK plus BK plus CK. So I told you this. Now we want to apply this plus CK. So here, when the degree is 3, you write S1 is what? A plus B plus C. S2 is what? Is A squared plus B squared plus C squared. S3 is A cubed plus B cubed plus C cubed. We can find this, but... For example, S456 is hard to find with only using these things. But there is an important rule. When the degree is 3 for S after 4, after S4, you say what? You replace here. S4 minus 3S. You write the exact coefficient here, same coefficient, minus S3 minus 4S2 plus S1, 5S1 equals zero and then you can write it for any k that is greater than equal four so you can also write for five in this problem we need only to find for s until s6 so minus three s4 you increase the indices by one s3 plus five s2 equals zero and the next one s6 minus three s5 minus four s4 plus five s 3 equals 0. So we can find S1, S1, S2, S3, S4, S5, S6. So if we find these S's, then we can solve the problem. So now I told you the Newton's idea is what? For, for example, degree 3, you write S1, S2, S3. And for S, after S4, you can use this Newton's idea. And the proof is so much easy, so much easy. If you had any question about the proof of this, you can send message to my WhatsApp number, but here let me tell you, for example, for this part, how we can say this. I want to prove that SK minus 3SK minus 1 minus 4SK minus 2 
plus 5sk minus 3 is 0. And we know k is at least 4. I want to prove this. So I know the main equation is what? If the main equation is this one. So I say what? I say... So because the main equation is this. So one root is what? One root is a. So a cubed minus 3a squared minus 4a plus 5 is 0. b cubed minus 3b squared minus 4b plus 5 is 0. The next one, c cubed minus 3c squared minus 4c plus 5 is 0. Now, we want to reach what? We want to reach sk. sk we know is what? Is ak plus bk plus ck. So if we multiply it by k, a k minus 3. So it will be what? It will be ak minus 3, ak minus 1. Minus 4, ak minus 2, plus 5, ak minus 3, equals 0. Then, if you multiply this one by b, k minus 3, it will be bk minus 3, bk minus 1 minus 4, bk minus 2, plus 4, bk minus 3 is 0. And the next one, if you multiply it by ck minus 3, ck minus 3, ck minus 1, minus 4, ck minus 2, plus 5 ck minus 3 equals 0. If you add up these three equations, the first column, ak, bk, ck, it will be sk. This one will be negative 3 sk minus 1. This one will be negative 4 sk minus 2. And the last one plus 5 sk minus 3 equals 0. So we proved this. And, uh, okay, Newton, some important idea that in recent years in Olympia, they use also in other examples. Now I want to solve the problem let's uh, in hard problems you will first of find this and a little focus on assumption and then also focus on the sentence of the problem what we want to find so here let me find this one here a plus b plus c we said is three by vieta's formula now if we use that here i can say okay it's what Instead of a, you can write a4 plus b4 because a plus b plus c is 3. I can say, okay, for example, a plus b is 3 minus c. So I say it is 3 minus c plus b4 plus c4. It is 3 minus a plus c4 plus a4 over 3 minus b. Now, if we use common denominators, it will be what here? Let me calculate. 3 minus C, 3 minus A, 3 minus B. And the first one is A4 plus B4 times 3 minus A times 3 minus B. And then also the similar terms. Now, if we calculate, here we have what? Negative 3A5. And then... Uh, negative 3a5, if we consider also negative, this one, this one, negative 3a4b, and then 9 plus 9a4, and plus ab this, plus a5b. And you can write for also this term, exact things, and the denominator is what? 3 minus C, it will be 27. And 9 plus, minus 9, A plus B plus C. And plus 3, AB plus AC plus BC. And plus 27, okay? So, here we know A plus B plus C is 3. And AB plus AC plus BC was what here? Let me show you. AB plus AC plus BC by Vieta's formula, negative 4. So we found the denominator is what? Now we should focus on numerator. Okay, if we want to focus on numerator, let's see, it is what? A5 you have, and also B5 in this part. So you can say we have two negative 3A5, look, A and B, you have negative 3A5, for AC also, you have negative. So it will be negative 6A5 plus B5 plus C5. 
5. And also let's consider 9a4. We have 2 9a4 because for a4, c4 also we have that plus 18. a4 plus b4 plus c4. And okay, so here we can say we have a4b, ab4, something like this. You say, okay, negative 3 a4 plus b4 plus c4 times a plus b plus c then you cover negative 3a4b negative 3a4a all of them but we have some terms we should subtract it is what a5 we have negative 3a5 so we should add them to cancel b5 c5 and we've corrected we found this the next one a5 b5 c5 so we write a5 plus b5 plus c5 times a plus b plus c then we create all a5 b all of them except you create something that you should subtract a6 b6 c6 so you should subtract a6 b6 c6 so it's good this good this is a good problem to learn how to work with these types of hard problems that have many terms okay now if i want to write in terms of s it will be negative 6 s5 plus 18 s4 minus 3 s4 s1 plus 3 s5 plus s5 s1 minus s6 okay here now we should find s1 to s6 to solve this problem and here we know the denominator so let's find s1 to s6 so here as you can see we had these formulas and here let me copy all these terms okay to find all s1 to s6 okay so let's go a little further okay so here let me write with black s1 is what s1 is 3 because of a plus b plus s2 is what is a squared plus b squared plus c squared you can say it is what it is a plus b plus c squared minus 2ab plus ac plus bc. It is what? It is negative 4 because by Vieta's formula, a plus b plus c is what? 3. So 3 squared 9, it is plus 8, 17. So we found s2 is 7. Now we want to find s3. We can find s3 with an important formula. It is a plus b plus c times a squared plus b squared plus c squared minus a b minus a c minus b c. This identity is also useful in other algebraic problems. a plus b plus c is what is 3, we said. a squared plus b squared is s2. s2 was what? 17. This one minus this is minus minus 4 is plus 4. A, B, C is what? Negative 5. So here it is what? 3 times 17 plus 4, 21 minus 15. So it is what? 63 minus 15. 13 minus 5, 8. 5 minus 1, 4. 48. So S3 is what? Is 48. Now we want to use these formulas. So S1, let me write S1 was what? 3. 3, 17, 48. 3, 17, 48. Now I want to find what? I want to find at first S4 and then I find S5 and all of them. Okay, the next one S4, I use the formula here. S4 minus 3 S3. 3 times this, 3, 8, 24, 2, 1, 4, 4. Minus 4 S2, which is 68 plus 5s1 which is 15 equals 0 so s4 is sum of them 8 plus 4 12 we have 1 6 plus 4 10 plus 1 11 we have 1 1 plus 1 2 minus 15 and 12 minus 5 is 7 uh, it's 0 it will be 9 1 9 7 now we use the same rule for s finding s5 s5 minus 3 s4 minus 3 197 minus 4 s3 s3 is what 48 plus 5 s2 which is what 17 equals 0 now if you calculate 
it will be what? 5 times 7, 35, 3, 85, 32, 3, 19, 2, 9, 5. So, S4, S5 will be this plus this, 2 plus 1, 3, 9 plus 1, 9, 18. We have 1, 1 plus 5, 6, and 7. Minus 85, which equals 13 minus 5, 8. We have 7 minus 17 minus 8, 9, 6, 7, 8. And the last one is what is, you say, okay, S6 minus 3S5, which is 6, 9, 8, minus 4S4, which is 1, 9, 7, plus 5S3, which is 5 times 48, equals 0. Now, if you calculate 4, 24. 28, we have 2, 38, 3, 7, 4, 2, 29, 2, okay, it is this. Now, if we calculate S6, it will be this plus this, 4 plus 8, 12, 1, 18, 1, 8, and 2, minus 240. It will be what, 2, 8 minus 4, 4, 8 minus 2, 6, and 2. Okay, now I write all of them in one line. Okay, S1 to S6 are these. Now let's calculate the sentence. Okay, here. Now we want to calculate numerator. It will be negative 6S5, 6, 9, 8, plus 18 S4, 1, 9, 7, minus 3S4, 1, 9, 7, S1, 3, plus 3S5, 3, 9, 8, plus S5, 6, 9, 8, S1, 3, minus S6, 4, 2. Okay, so now calculate this one. Okay, if you calculate, it will be negative 8, 6, 9. And now let's calculate this one. It is 27 minus 27, 0, negative. Okay, negative uh, 12 plus 27, it's what the denominator? Uh, 17 minus 12 is 5, 1. Okay, in previous part, we said what here? Negative 3, 3, 3, when we multiply 27 minus this plus this, I should correct, it is negative 27. Now, if I, because it is negative ABC, and ABC is what? Uh, uh, let's check it again. ABC is negative 5. Uh-huh. ABC is negative 5. So, uh-huh. Okay. So, negative ABC. Let me correct this part. Negative. It will be negative ABC, and ABC is what here? Negative 5. So, uh, it, it will be plus 5. And if we calculate, they will be canceled. 3 times negative 4, negative 12, 5, negative 7. So now we found the denominator is negative 7, so it will be negative 8, 6, 9 over negative 7. And it will be 8, 6, 9, 869 over 7. Okay, now in this problem, we consider two important rules, Vietas and Newtons. If you have any question about the solution of this problem or ideas or theorems, feel free to send a message to my WhatsApp number in the description comments also. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and turn on the notification and like my video to have next videos and you can use my playlist. There are lots of problems of Stanford, Harvard and by solving them and for America, British, by solving them you can increase, improve your problem.